State health officials say this week we will pass 2 million vaccine doses administered so far. And WJZ is live. Paul Gessler on the website up this weekend to get more people pre-registered and how the state is performing compared with other states. Paul. Denise, as lawmakers have mentioned, we are leaving a period of scarcity and moving, entering in a period of abundance. In an oversight hearing Monday, they urged state leaders to fix any problems with the vaccine rollout once it becomes available to more groups. Maryland, I think, is right in the middle. Maryland now in the middle of the national pack on the vaccination effort, up from last month when the state was among the bottom on population vaccinated. The demand is there. People are on waiting lists. They're not just not getting the shots. Demand yeah. is not the issue. Organization of delivery is the issue. State senators briefed Monday urged the state health department to actively pull up underperforming counties like Prince George's. Unfortunately, the supply has not increased yet. That will change overnight when the supply changes. Maryland's one-stop pre-registration site launched this weekend. The state's acting health secretary says 35,000 have signed up so far, and those who call the GoVax hotline without getting an appointment can be pre-registered as well. And over three quarters of the calls that are coming into MD GoVax are actually not getting appointment. People are spending a lot of time on hold. They're getting very frustrated. And then at the end of that, they're actually most people are actually not able to get an appointment. Senator Mary Washington rose concerns of ethics, calling on people to wait their turn until more vulnerable groups can get their shots. I do believe that that's the bully pulpit that you and the governor can be using. There's also a moral dimension to this, Senator that people will use their good judgment and, and their moral compass to do the right thing. We're not going to police the vaccine centers. Now, on Friday, Maryland vaccinated a daily high of more than 56,000 people. Reporting live at 5 tonight, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ.